Hello, my name is Linda Crouch. Coming to Mexico this September was my second time serving with Time Missions. Building on the foundation of the previous time I was here a year ago left a strong imprint on my heart. This time I knew what I was coming to, I knew the ministries we were hoping to have, and I knew the people that I would be serving alongside. But whenever we're willing to fit in with what God is doing around the world, life is never same old, same old. He's always doing a new thing in our lives. Our schedule included speaking to ladies in a local church group and leading baking classes for women, both in the community and in a rural church. One afternoon, Jess, Jackie, Paola, and I headed to back-to-back -back ministries to interact with middle school and high school girls, share our testimonies, teach how to bake chocolate chip cookies, and share how God speaks our love language. It was exciting to see the girls grasp ways to receive God's love and then share that same love with each other. I found them to be receptive and eager to learn. And I believe time staff will return to build on those relationships with the girls. As we waited to return home, a car drove up filled with other back-to-back -back missionaries. What a surprise it was to see three Nigerians get out of the car. I was a missionary in Nigeria myself for almost 40 years, so seeing someone from my home country was like a surprise love gift from God. An even bigger surprise came when I spoke to them in Hausa and they responded. On hearing my name and my Hausa greetings, one man said, are you Crouch? When I said yes, he went on to say that he had known our family and remembered even taking mangoes and tangerines from our yard. What a delight to visit and to see God cause our paths to cross again in such an unexpected way. Reflecting later on our interaction, I remembered how I had reminded the girls that God knows and sees and loves us and shows that he speaks our love language. He had just given me the kind gift of an old Nigerian acquaintance, show up here in Mexico of all places. I praise God for the opportunity I have had to work alongside Time Mission staff these last two weeks here in Monterey. Even though I'm 71 years old, I've been encouraged that if I'm willing and available for God to use me, He uses the overflow of my life to count for eternity.